Good afternoon. My name is Greg Olson. I'm the general manager of Pull-Up Buy Refining in Corning, Iowa. At our plant, we employ 44 full-time employees who work together to produce 73 million gallons of ethanol and 207,000 tons of animal feed last year. We pay over $480,000 in taxes to the county, and we are an active member in our local community. I'm here again this year to speak from the perspective of a plant manager who only wants to produce fuel and hopes in the future to have a cellulosic plant to manage. I hope to use my short time here to give you a picture of why I'm concerned about the future of my plant and the small town our team so dearly loves. As I mentioned last year, the company I work for, Poet, recently launched the first of its kind cellulosic facility in Emmitsburg, Iowa. It's not too far from Corning. In conversations I had with executives from our headquarters back in 2013 and earlier, they spoke about how I would need to prepare our plant to bolt on a new cellulosic project in the future. I was not the only poet general manager to have those discussions. For Corning, that would mean a whole new plant constructed and a whole bunch of new jobs created. It would mean new revenues for our 1,860 farmer suppliers and more trucks that need to drive to bring the biomass to our facility. Last year, I mentioned that discussions around bringing a cellulosic plant to Corning had quieted. Unfortunately, corporate continues to indicate they are uncertain if EPA is committed to increasing volumes of ethanol to statutory levels. I continue to hear from my executives terms like regulatory uncertainty and lack of market access, an unclear path to commercialization. In one conversation, I was told, that if we are willing to cut the total renewable volumes by 200,000 gallons, they may be willing to pull the rug out from underneath us on a more expensive and risky cellulosic project. Like last year, the only request that I have for you today is please do whatever you can to ensure that those in charge at POET feel that there is enough certainty to keep rolling out new cellulosic plants. If what is on these pages of the RVO proposal is not strong enough, please make it stronger. Our town has done everything that has been asked of it under the RFS. We have created a significant amount of American-made fuel that is cheaper and cleaner for American drivers, and we are ready to do more. Give our company's leadership the confidence it needs to build and grow the biofuels industry. Thank you for all your hard work and for the attention given to our concerns.